Hi everybody. In this video I'm going to show you how I uh, turn the profile on the uh, jam nut and the handle. So I got my compound set to seven degrees to profile the uh, jam nut. So let's start there. View. Let's get it in frame. How to do? pretty close let's take a look at what we got here make sure it's cleaned up all the way around and that's pretty close a little bit of a flat spot right there but I'm gonna go with it, it doesn't look bad at all now I've got to adjust the compound to 25 degrees. That was set at 7, so I'm going to move this to 25. Loosen up my compound here and let's move it to 25 degrees. And lock it down. Set. 25 degrees. Alright, now let's see if my tool's okay. Oh, yeah, I can live with that. I gotta get right down in here. Okay. chips and press on Thing you have to live with with the plastic is these stringy chips. And they can make it hard to see.
we're getting close here. Okay, and that's as far as I can take it. That's as far as I can take it. So now I gotta pull it out of the chuck and I'll turn it around. Let's see how there's a few things I can do here to help the run out. That's not too bad, and I'll show you why. So now what I have to do, zoom this out so you can see. I'm going to turn it 25 degrees the other direction. Loosen this up. Twenty-five degrees this way. Lock it down. This time I'll have to turn my tool. Get in there and Let's dig it as close as we can. chips try to get it as close as I can this way and I'll finish it with Handles now shaped. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the seven degree. I've got a seven degree angle I put on up here now. So let me put this in here. And I'm going to 
take the uh, compound back to the seven degrees. Set to seven. Angle looks good on the tool. We'll leave it there. The compound tighten down. And I just kind of eyeball this, see where I want to, see how far in I want to go. I leave about 20 thousandths away from the, uh, just eyeballing it, 20, 25 thousandths away from that locator tab. And let's go. Get in on it. Put it all back together here. It's almost done. All I need now is a piston, a spring, and a test drive. That's all I got today. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.